John Hart is an expert in severe storms, a meteorologist, and the lead forecaster at the Storm Prediction Center, part of the National Weather Service in Norman, Oklahoma. Daniel Turdeman brought CNET's road trip here to Tornado Alley to learn how Hart and his fellow meteorologists work with real-time data from satellite and radar, information on surface temperatures, winds, moisture, and even lightning strikes, and then coordinate with 122 local offices around the country to forecast the kinds of storms, especially tornadoes and severe thunderstorms, that cause the most danger to people's lives and to property. If Hart does issue what he calls a coordinated watch, then it's up to the local offices in the area that may be affected to issue the actual severe weather warning you hear via local media or your favorite weather apps. Try to visualize, if Grandma lives in that county, do I want her in a watch or not? Is, is the risk really true there? So I'm in, actually issuing about 100 watches there. Each county, uh, I have a choice whether to put it in or not. Um, once I have it in the right place, uh, we start a conference call. And so for in, the, in this case, Wichita, Topeka, Kansas City, Springfield, Missouri, St. Louis, all of these offices would be on the call. I would describe my thought process as to why I thought there'd need, a watch, need to be a watch. And then um, they would give me their feedback on, well, I don't think so, or could we add these counties or subtract? And when the, when the whole process is over, um, then I go ahead and transmit our collaborated watch. And hopefully we put it in the right place. And then, you know, from there, the, the field then takes it and issues warnings. Tornado and severe thunderstorm warnings become the, the primary focus after that. 